Okay, question five. So question five is um, worth four marks. Okay, it's the, it's the first compare question. There's two compare questions. It's the first one. You need to be making two points, but you need to write two quotes for each point. Yeah, so a quote from each extract. You need to avoid terminology. You don't need to use it. And lengthy exploration. So again, this is only a four mark question, so we don't want to spend too much time on it. This question wants you to synthesize information from two texts. This means you must read both texts carefully, find and then combine the info required in your answer. It's worth four marks, so you should be spending five to six minutes on it. Now you need to make two points with a quote from both extracts on each. You need to identify basic similarities and differences. You've already read both texts in the exam, so you're going to be familiar with them, so you'll just be scanning the information at this stage. You can say both texts are the same or different. Be clear which text you're talking about, so really easy way is just to use the author's names. Terminology is not needed, so you can use it if you want to, but you don't need to use loads of it, yeah, if, if any. So similar or different, so I would comment on the following things being similar or different. The ideas talked about, the point of view, the language, the structure. So language of comparison in pairs create a list of phrase that can be used to show how two things are similar, blah, blah, blah. Whatever. Yeah, so basically things we're saying that are the same are likewise, similarly, also, two, as well as, and both. Things that are different. But, however, whereas, on the other hand, yet in contrast. Okay, so left is same, right is different. So try to use these, remember we're comparing them, so try to use these in your answer to show the examiner you are comparing and contrasting. You need to track through both texts for key parts about the question. In this case, we're looking at how clothing equipment has changed over time. So I want you to go through the both extracts and highlight anything to do about clothing and equipment. So here's the first extract. And basically, in the first extract, it's in this little bit here. There's, there's two paragraphs where they talk about clothing and equipment. Okay, so first of all, he says it's expensive. He spent a small fortune. Then he says he also does it to feel part of the team. So he feels streamlined. He wants to be part of the brotherhood. And then he says he uses a health helmet for safety. And then we need to pay, make a point that now this equipment is fluorescent. So it's very bright clothing that they wear. Well, the other extract is really only this paragraph here. So let's zoom in on that paragraph. So the main points about the clothing equipment in this one are basically it's normal clothing. She wore normal clothing. Okay, even though she thought even though she thought it was a costume, it still wasn't no normal clothing. So both extracts think they need a special um, equipment. In contrast to the 21st century text, is very simple. So the other one was like a luminous, and it's not bright. It just says modest. <coughs> so 21st century. The kit is expensive, he wears a helmet, it's very bright, the clothing is worn to go faster, he thinks it's needed, he thinks it's, it's important. 19th century, it's dull clothing, it's normal clothing, and she thinks it's needed too. So how are we going to structure our answer? So overview as a whole, so you need to say what both texts, what, what you think both texts agree with or disagree with, then a quote from each one, so you, and then the same for the second point. So you need to make t two main points, two main things that you've noticed in the extract. So things they have in common or things that are different, mainly similar. So use the sentence starter, both writers. Then give your overview, the main point of the question. So I'm going to say both writers agree that cycling needs special equipment and clothing. And all I need to do then is say the quote from each one. So this question is all about really picking out information. So you don't need to say this suggests or anything like that. Just give the information you found out. So both writers agree that cycling needs special equipment. St Charles says where specially bought clothing that made is lycra and makes him feel streamlined. Well, likewise, okay, I'm using that word. I'm using the word to compare, so likewise, so I'm saying what is similar, Francis thinks wearing a costume is a must, so make sure you have your quotes. Okay, so both writers agree that cycling needs special equipment, Charles wears specially bought clothing that's made of lycra and makes him feel streamlined, likewise, Francis makes wearing a costume is a must. So my red is my main point, then my black is my quote to back it up. 
Okay, and remember I'm using my adverbial, so simile on the other hand, likewise in contrast. Okay, let's do a second point. Now I'm going to say in both texts they differ. So I'm saying they do something differently. So in both texts they differ on the type of clothing worn. Again, just to quote to back it up. Charles wear bright fluorescent clothing which cost a small fortune. It's suggested it's worn for cycling but also to fit into the biking brotherhood. And then in contrast, I'm just using that word, Francis' clothing is simple, modest and due to the period has no focus on bike performance. She wears a straw hat as opposed to Charles' helmet which shows no great attention. So basically all I'm doing is all my quotes about the cl that clothing that I've picked out and I'm using that to back up my point and there it all is together and if you've got time it's only a four mark question so don't do this if you haven't got time but if you've got time finish with a summing up sentence so my one is in summary I've owed bike both agree specific biking uniform is required the 21st century gear has evolved due to the need for speed and safety okay and there it all is together pause if you want to read